Hello, welcome back to AJM Learn. So excited about this one. Squarespace just announced that we can now finally upload files to a form. Oh my gosh. Okay, so let me show you how to do it. Um, in the post, you'll see this. I've, I do have a secondary option because as I'm recording this, this is only available to Circle members. Um, I'm not sure when they're releasing it fully. Um, but yeah, really excited. I do in the post have a second option. I'm not going to show that in this video, but I did find a really cool third party, not an affiliate link. It's literally just like the solution I found that really worked great. So check that out if you don't have access to this yet. So if you do, and when you do just come on in to your form. So as usual, you know, add a block, add a form in here. When you're editing the form, go to edit form fields, add field and oh my God, <laughs> file upload. So happy to see that. Pretty cool. So awesome. People can upload files now. Also, excuse my crazy. You're used to seeing my sandbox if you look at my videos, but excuse how lovely it looks. Okay. Options. Um, as usual, the normal stuff. So the label of um, this form field. So you could change the name if you wanted, like upload your resume. Um, you know, if this was maybe for a job, you can add a description, make it required or not required as usual. What's really cool here is you can also allow only specific file types. Um, you know, so if you were asking specifically for a video, you don't want people uploading a bunch of other junk. Um, same with, you know, a document. If you're saying, Hey, I want your resume, but do not send me a word doc. Um, you can, you know, kind of say this has to be actually lies, I guess, document. So it would be doc, PDF, et cetera. So they are kind of grouped that way, but I guess instead of being like, yeah, don't send me a JPEG, I need an actual PDF, whatever. So you can specify, and then you can also, uh, specify the max number of files up to five. So this is kind of cool. Again, just limiting people so they're not uploading stuff you don't need. Um, super simple. And I want to show you where this goes. So it goes two places. Um, as usual, when someone fills out your form, the form submission will come to your email and this the download for this file will be right there. The other place it goes is over if you go to your contacts. Um, this is my sandbox. So I have like one single form submission because it's just for, for this. Um, but you go into your contacts and go into form submitters. There it will be. And um, you can click into the form itself. So you'll see all the forms that person submitted. And then you will get that file upload right there. I have my resume, which I won't show you. All right, cool. Hope you enjoy. I know we're all super excited for this one.